A bam and welcome to Creeper World, everybody. Uh, today we are playing a another player's creep map where the people are not going to be rebuilding, which sounds just just fantastic, just amazing. Uh, there's a whole load of things for us to attack. I like these little kind of like kind of magenta walls, uh, like little outposts. They're kind of a, a fun fun idea. A lot of choke points leading up the map, so we need to be a little careful. Uh, and we only have this boy, who is not producing a lot. I think we're going to have to give him some buffs. Uh, so I have a little idea on what I want to do. Uh, in a previous map that we played, uh, we managed to get a stash just going crazy. And I sort of want to see if we can make that happen again. And I kind of want to just beeline straight forward. Is it better just to carve through the map, or do we go around? Maybe around is the safer but longer option. Although we actually have to deal with that. No. Through the middle. Now I need to save up some boosts. I think I need maybe about 50 boosts to get that guy working in full full effect. That guy, you definitely need to go. The John Rambo of cannons. Uh, here. Hello, John Rambo. Have a rock. You can have a rock. Will that punch you that shield? Ooh, maybe not. Okay, so at the moment we're on like 30k, that number is, well, kind of bouncing around that. Ooh, goosebumps are like good solid 35 when all of the blue zones start producing for us. We're definitely going to be running into a few more guns here. What are you? Spore launcher. I don't know if we need, need you for my plan just yet. Uh, I can't go around the back, we do have to come around the right hand side of this. But the rest of the creep is kind of doing pretty good, and we managed to free air sacs who are going to go off and... Do air sack stuff. Uh, I'm not too worried about what they're getting up to this very second. Okay, these guys are being unfriendly. Oh, air sack actually came to help. All right, that guy should just get killed. All right, up the mountain. Not a lot of defense up here. There's just one cannon that we need to look at, but. Okay. I like that the SX is sort of attacking where I want to be. That's kind of handy. Is that thing going to get killed? Well, if we help it, will. How's everything else doing? It's been a great push up here. It's probably going to free some skimmers, which is kind of fun. I got all the eggs. God, do we just go for eggs? Egg strap? Extract 5,000. Okay, just pop, pop, pop. Once you pop, you just can't stop. Uh, that is the tagline for eggs in Creeper World. Okay, right, we must connect it up. There was another M Rift, which is there, which is danger close to where my boys are. So, uh, pop, pop, pop. And. Okay. Right. So we get up to 16,000, and then we're trying to remove the cooldown timer on it. Okay, it's going to take a, a red-hot minute to actually get that. God, we're just not actually making enough creep. Because our front line is so big, it's kind of just getting spread out everywhere. I'm hoping once this thing kicks into gear, we're at 76,000. It's going to take us a red-hot minute to actually get, get there, but this will hopefully just make us all the creep in the world. Do we just keep buffing you? How much isn't an egg? A lot. Okay, blam. Right, it's kicked into gear. So, it produces 32,000. Then it absorbs half of that and produces another 32,000. Like, look at this. Look at these numbers going up. Like, you can see on the chart just how much creep this thing is putting out. So we're on... I don't know. God, I instantly forgot. 80? 90? So we've already kind of... Well, getting close to doubling the amount of creep on the map just from this stash. What a power play. Uh, we can make it better... I don't know how much it really helps at this stage, because it feels like it's already kind of doing pretty good. Right, where do I want to attack? 
It'd be nice to take out their factory. See, that checkpoint is not great for me to actually drive through. So, I've got a plan. Let's just slow down. Do they have snipers? Right, we're gonna make our own road. Uh, bobble eggs. Get a load of mesh. And rather than trying to sneak my way through that narrow gap, let's just go around. Oh, that's a cool design. Like a little uh, little shield with a gun in it. Okay, all right, this will be our main route. Because you can already see how dense it is by here. It's so dense. And then it has to go through just a few tiny little openings. So that is just massively slowing me down. But with the new bypass, we can just go around. Oh my god, like, look how much creep we're on now. This thing is really efficient. Wow, maybe Stash. New coolest guy. Like, it's not the... <laughs> the... the most subtle tactic. Just, I make a lot of creep. But it certainly is a fun strat. Oh no, the bypass. The bypass was ruined. Okay. Well, it still kind of works. Uh, let's just shave that side. Because there's blue grounds that we couldn't build over. Uh, we have all the eggs in the world, which probably could be helping people out. They've got an emrift up there, which might be fun to smash. Massive overkill on the eggs, but I just wanna I just wanna come across. And we may as well take out the emrift. Because that will upset them greatly. There's one there as well. Can we sneak in there? Yes, is the answer. Okay, where's their next? Wow, they're having to come from an emerald really far back. Oh no, there's one over here. 18 eggs. Let's try it out. Eight eggs. God, I'm kind of going not the fastest route, am I? Can we just pop, 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 pop. Ooh, okay. That's a big chunk that has now been cut off. Okay, who wants to be attacked next? I guess you. I guess we could just plow into this guy and take out his shields. Although... Shields need arg, right? Can we just turn that off? Is it arg? God, I always, like, forget. Yeah. Arg, not lift deck. Okay, well, when the shields go down, there shall be a cry from the people. Hark! Our shields, the only thing protecting us from from the creep. And I shall laugh, a deep guttural laugh. <laughs> uh bam, there you go. That's part of my uh my memoirs called Tom the Creepy Guy. Which is not that's not a good name for a book. Are they still getting arg from somewhere? Yes. There. I see you, Jig Sully. Do we have enough to make a new bridge? Okay, honestly, I don't think you really need to put that many more buffs into into the stash. Like, once you've got that engine running, I I think it's kind of fine. Uh, here you go. Just keep piling in. Almost at the factory. I guess, well, we can just hasten the pace in here with... Just rock em, sock em robots. Doing pretty good. I don't like that they're shooting me, so let's just try and blow that up. Nice! Spores coming in. They have almost no production left, so... I think... Well, obviously we've, we've won, but I think we've got... <laughs> wow, 2.6 million! a lot. Pretty good. Pretty efficient. Bobble legs. ka -chow. Wows. I Cthulhu did it in 11 minutes. Ooh, for fun. Did it in 5. Can we do it in 5? I don't think I can. Okay, bam! Uh, we've got another map uh, created by No Exit, the third in their series. And this one warns of anti-creep. Uh-oh. Is there... There's the stash. <laughs> uh, is my dirty laugh. Okay, do we just go straight for it? Do we just do stash balls? We could just egg over. Oh, we're not really connected onto the mainland. 
but we're kind of getting in. We should probably try and take these guys out, because they're actually a bit of a nightmare. Uh, we've got a little hole. I kind of hate having to patch up the holes. It's kind of tough to do. Okay, it's just going around. We've got a horrible little little bit of a problem in there. Okay, we're just going to go over there. I can probably avoid a lot of problems outside of the planes. The planes are not going to be super chill with me. God, there's those bits around the, the coast, which are kind of hard to do. The little, all the fiddly bits. I'm not going to win any awards for this. Okay, right, let's get you. Oh, God. Yeah, you really need to just overkill it with the eggs to, like, actually get those landings working. Oh, heck. Just go for it. Right, how are we looking? Lot of AC on the map. 45,000. We've only made 9k in a uh, creep. We've already technically made more than that, uh, but these guns have just been blasting me pretty hard. Okay. Big central stash. Come on, bud. Okay, tons of AC. Right, let's just kickstart the engine as best as we can before that anti-creep comes in and ruins this whole plan. There we go. Great. It popped. Right, lot of creep. And it's not quite there yet. But see, it needs to be like kicking off before the creep starts flowing out. Now look at us. Now we're beginning to catch up. 30k? Where's the main source of their AC? That back area for sure. Down there, big problem. We could take this part. I think if I mesh in that direction. If we can take over this zone, I think that'll help a lot. Okay. Kind of blasting some of them. Feels good. And inching my way towards this zone. Not gonna yet, but we have managed to shut down some of their weapons. Uh, rock. Nice. Okay, just want that super mortar dead. Great. Okay, I think we are very close to be able to take over this means of production. Uh, we are still definitely losing the the AC wars. Do we have the power to to hold that? Uh, kind of. It's a pretty even battle. Uh, if we can shut down their guns that are nearby. Then, I think we have got it. Okay, that should tip the scales slightly further in my favor. Alright, what else do I need to look for? Okay, they've got loads of AC back there. Okay, very secure little M rift up there, but we can take out some of these towers. Okay, maybe the trick here is we just use the Dark Tower. Save up our boosts and Dark Tower it up. What else do we have? Spores. We've got a spore launcher somewhere. There. I don't think that's going to be doing the business. There seems to be like too many missile launchers for me to really, really do that. Uh, so I would rather... I'd like to get the Skimmer Factory. And you know what? We're trying to fight where they want to fight. Which is not the winning strap, I fear. Uh, that was maybe way too many eggs. But it allows me to make a proper road. Rather than these, like, janky, not-so-good ones. Uh, but if I can come up and get skimmers... Skimmers are probably worth the worth boost. With only a few eggs, we could take that out. Cutting off this portion of the map. They'll have m rifts, but... Oh, they've got a connector over there. Nice. Uh, yeah, we can we can kind of like snip snip a few of those bits. Blammo. Okay, one less gun to worry about. Rocks. Get rid of that gun. Okay, that means we should just be able to mesh into the shield and ignore... Ignore what they're up to. Slow and steady wins the race. And then we'll get some skimmers to play. Oh, my egg. Great. Just in time. Uh, right, Skimmer Factory. Yeah, bust that up. 
Like, they're not going to be doing a ton of work, but I think they will help. Man, the amount of AC is actually really managing to keep me at bay now. Let's just flat an AC just so I can see what is going on. Okay, Dark Tower Online. Very good. Oh, wait. Is this whole area just that? Pop, 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 pop. Oh, no. Remember, we spoke about the pylon. Blammo! Okay, great. We've got a whole, whole area. If I can take that, I'd like to move in down here and stop this producing. Oh, and if we can get that corner, and then we can just sort of take a diagonal slice of the map and then fight it as two halves rather than one mega, mega map. Uh, emitter making creep. Do we super care? It doesn't hurt to buff it up, but we are kind of beginning to war. War? Win the war. I'd kind of like to get the air sacs. I feel like they would actually be pretty good. Like, just super buff them. Because they would throw down quite a lot of creep. Okay, MRF there. It's not super crucial. And it's a bit harder to snipe an MRF when it's really drowned in, drowned in creep. It just costs a lot more eggs than you'd expect. Where are you guys getting ammo from? Here. Can we easily stop that? I'm going to say with 18 eggs, yes. Okay, right. Pop all eggs. Uh-oh. Oh god, they already cleared a load of it out. Okay, we might have to go bad mesh bridge. Right, not super clean, but we're kind of making it up. How's everyone else doing? Good push down here. And we are slowly winning the war of attrition. We are outproducing now. Okay. That is the all-important tower. It's just turned off all of this. Okay. Very good. A very shooty part of their base. Now, let's get that connected back in. And... Urn port, I think, is next. Okay, right. Where are your emeralds? That guy, pretty tough to take out. That one's real deep. We've just been using our eggs pretty frivolously. But... Maybe it's worth... Worth the gamble. Okay, right. We can connect it up. I think I'm gonna need more than one egg to smash up here. Two might do it. Pop, 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 pop. And... One more egg. Great. Okay, so that's disconnected. These guys now have to get all of their supplies from this side of the base. Everything goes through this. Prep that with rocks. There we go. Blammo. Uh, great. This whole area has been turned off. Uh, the moment this thing comes online... Well, let's just start buffing it now. Uh, because I just want something to throw down and just help to clear out anti creep. Okay, a lot of good boys. Look at them go. Just dropping some, drop some some stuff. All right. Hopefully this back area should fall pretty quickly. Uh, not that it matters because it's not like it's getting them any resources. This back corner, it does, but that's fine. Okay, air sacs. Uh, you're just here to mainly just blob, blob around. That is so many snipers. Oh my god, wow. Air sacs. It is making them use a lot of ammo, though. Uh, wowzers. What oh, brave boys. <laughs> oh my god, the amount of missiles. Oh my god. <laughs> my poor boys. I did not realize how savage a gun line you were going to have to deal with. Okay, what I want to do is... See if we can just kind of freight train our way just straight into that factory. Because they've got the snipers. But if we can shut down their missile production, they won't actually be able to kill off my air sacs very easily. Okay. Right, just absolutely overkill it, and then make that bridge. Okay. Look at these long boys! Oh god, the missiles! Oof! That guy just being armed straight from the factory puts out a lot of firepower. Airship actually doing a pretty good job. 
Okay, can I snipe that tower? Yes. Yes, I can. Uh, okay, that guy is still getting armed, which isn't super good, but are the other missile launchers going to start running out? Okay, shields are running out. That means missile launchers are going to be running out. Right, the airships, airships can, you know, sort of hold their own. But down here, there's no air cover whatsoever, so yeah, just drop creep on them. Wow, actually, can we just take that M-Rift? And... Nice! Another section has fallen. Airship struggling to get ammo, which is very good. Uh, right. Airsex. Just buff them up. I think we can just enjoy just the dance of the airsex. As they come in and bombard. There is no way for them to stop them. I think it's like snipers are kind of thinning the ammo out a little bit, but it's not enough. And just random things are getting blown up every now and again. Yeah, that money is going down. The air sacks are doing. Ooh, skimmer did a good skimming somewhere. What the hell? Good job. I kind of thought this was just going to be the uh, the dance of the air sacks, but no, if you want to get skimmy... Uh, sounds great. Sounds real good. Okay, what do they even have left? Not a lot. Their money is just going down more and more. They're producing a bit of AC, but it's so many air sacks now. Blammo. We got them. Amazing. Very, very good. Uh, what a great, what a great map. Uh, very, very cool. Uh, pals, this has been Creep World, everybody. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. A big thank you to the maps by No Exit. Very much enjoyed. Uh, I think they're great. It's a nice change of pace to play, uh, play the ones where there's no AI. Um, like, it does make them easier, for sure. Um, but, you know, the Players Creep, like Players Creep maps, are always just sort of, you know, waiting off time and you will win. But they're real, real good. Very cool. Uh, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Until next time, see ya.